Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to take a look at Blackboard and how to hand in your assignments. Before we get started, go and download Google Chrome. Some things in Blackboard need it. Fire up that freshly downloaded browser. Go to utsa.blackboard.com. Your username will be your ABC123, and your password will be your passphrase. When you get into Blackboard, you'll see a few different areas, but we're going to check out Course List. Course List is a, you guessed it, list of your courses. To see what's going on in your class, select it from the list. Once you're inside, you'll see a navigation area on the left and a notification area on the right. The notification area is a great place to check out what's going on in your class. The navigation area is over on the left. Some instructors break this down into different areas and some have one big content area. Think of it as your chance to explore your course. Next, let's check out some things a professor might ask you to do. A discussion board post, an assignment, and bum bum bum, a test. Discussion posts are easy. They're just like talking in class. Find the discussion area of your course, pick the forum, and create thread. Now you can give it a subject, write your awesome response, and select submit. Boom. Done. Now let's check out an assignment. Mine just happens to be in an assignment area, but you know, remember yours could be in a different place. For an assignment, my professor wants me to write a script for a training video and hand in a Word doc. All I need to do is write out my script in Word, save it, select Browse My Computer and Blackboard, attach the file, and select Submit. Homework done. The last thing we have is the dreaded test. You might dread the content, but honestly the Blackboard part's pretty easy. I've gone to my test area and I've selected the test. Blackboard will give me some details about the test, and when I've read everything, I'll select Begin. I'm going to answer all my questions and ace this test. When I'm happy with everything, I'm going to select Save and Submit. Remember, your professor may have their course laid out in a different way. If you get stuck on anything, don't hesitate to ask them for help. It's kind of their job. If you need some technical support, you can reach out to Academic Innovation at utsa.edu.